Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to make a LED chaser using a triple five timer IC and a CD4017 decade counter IC. The speed of the running LEDs can be controlled by a potentiometer. We can build it on a small PCB, but let's build it on a breadboard first. Let's see the components we need in this project. A 555 timer, a CD4017 IC, a 10K potentiometer, a 10 microfarad capacitor, one 1K resistor, one 10K resistor, 10 pieces of LEDs, 10 pieces of 220 ohm resistors, some jumper wires, and we need a 9V battery with connector. Here all the components are ready, let's start building. Connect top and bottom power rails together. This will help us to get VCC and ground from both power rails. Keep the triple five IC notch on the left and place onto the breadboard. Pin 8 connected to 9 volt. It powers the timer IC. Pin 4 reset pin is connected directly to 9 volt. Pin 1 is connected to ground. Pin 2 trigger and pin 6 threshold are connected together. 10 microfarad capacitor is connected between pin 2 and ground. 10K resistor is connected between VCC and discharge pin 7. From pin 7 to 6, a 1K resistor and a 10K potentiometer are connected in a series. The potentiometer allows us to change the resistance, which directly changes the speed of the pulse. The triple five timer is used here in a stable mode, which means it continuously produce on and off pulse to the output pin 3. Now placed CD4017 IC onto the breadboard. The CD4017 is a decade counter, which means it counts clock pulse and activates one output at a time in a sequence. Pin 16 is connected to 9 volt to power the IC. Pin 8 is connected to ground. Pin 15 resets the counter back to Q0. This pin is connected to ground. Pin 13 is connected to ground. Pin 14 of CD4017 receives the clock pulses from pin 3 of the 555 timer. Now placed 10 pieces of LEDs onto the breadboard in the same sequence of polarity. Here I keep cathode terminal in the left. Connect all the cathode terminal of the LEDs to the ground through a 220 ohm resistor. Resistor will limit the current and protect the LEDs. Now we'll connect LEDs in a sequence with output pin of CD4017. Q0 is pin 3 connected to the first LED. Q1 is pin 2 connected to the second LED. Q2 is pin 4 connected to third LED. Q3 is pin 7 connected to fourth LED. Q4 is pin 10 connected to fifth LED. Q5 is pin 1 connected to sixth LED. Q6 is pin 5 connected to seventh LED. Q7 is pin 6 connected to eighth LED. Q8 is pin 9 connected to ninth LED and Q9 is pin 11, connected to 10th LED. Let's review the connections again. Connecting a 9V battery to the power rail will complete our project. We can increase or decrease the speed of LED chaser by simply rotating the potentiometer. This is a simple and beginner friendly electronics project. 
that helps you understand how timers, counters and clock pulses work together. Following the same circuit connection on PCB, you can make it more fun. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe to my channel for more electronics tutorials. And thank you for watching.